Yeah, hello, this is Serge David bringing you the next video in the top 10 most popular weapons in MAV by Kill Count. Number 5, Screamer Rocket. This rocket, this uh, weapon is a direct fire uh, heavy rocket that also has splash damage. It is very uh, large and cumbersome, but it has pretty good uh, range and the way that the shells travel you can lob it a lot farther than what you'd actually think you can do if you have a skill. So it has it's a very high skill ceiling weapon at long range. At close range it makes a lot of uh, dust and you have a lot of options for just pounding people. So let's go and take a look at it. Here we have I have a, uh, the build I'm going to use and show off the uh, rockets with. And I'm going to be doing uh, showing off the guns for all the following videos. And here's a lovely example of the Screamer Spiral, where this is connected to here, to connect to here, to connect to here, and connected to here. Allowing you having a pretty good uh, grouping. Uh, this has been slowly dying and leaving the wayside just due to the fact that Screamers are a lot heavier now, about 200 weight heavier, and they also uh, are fairly weak. So if you are doing a Screamer Spiral, it needs to be on something that's maneuverable enough, or you have some armor in front of it to keep them from uh, being blasted off, because uh, any snipers that see the Screamer Spiral from the side, one good uh, volley into one of these guns just ruins the entire thing. And uh, if you played at all the last patch, you'll uh, the balance update. You'll notice that screamer spirals were really in the meta, and snipers, likewise, were really excited about that. So let me go and get into a game and show it off. For me personally, I really like having the screamers on a real chassis. I just love the maneuverability of them. Uh, it fits with the weapons being fairly weak themselves. They have a lot of ammo, but it runs out really fast due to how fast you fire, which is another really good bonus for the weapon. It's definitely like, this is one of the builds I like to run, as it's a very harassing build for a scout. So I can go and harass people, and then I can also get up in their face and uh, get kills solo very easily. If you're very good, you can go and lob those shots from long range, especially if they're a slower moving target, or if they're not paying attention. It is a lot harder to land shots on humans, just because they, uh, when they get hit, they'll notice it. But definitely a really good weapon for team fights, because you can just go in there and just cause a lot of chaos, a lot of confusion. And you can just see how powerful these guns are. Against bases, they do three times the damage. So the damage around uh, 50 a shot. Bases take twice as much splash damage, and these are the only weapons that do direct aim splash damage in the game. So these weapons will actually do about 150 damage per shot, which can take down a base very fast. One of the downsides to this uh, build is because there is so much smoke that gets kicked up on impact, you can lose your target. Oh man, I should have been focused on that sniper. But like with that uh, biped, I kept losing sight of him in all the smoke. That's one of the things that you just have to uh, adjust for. And think about, especially if they're running away from you.
definitely a build that's very good against slower targets because of they have a they're close to um the shell velocity of howitzers a lot closer to that than uh, cannons I would say but if you do, if you want to scout this is a very viable build I believe they unlock around uh, attacker level 15 Or maybe it's attacker level 10. You can find out for sure and keep up to date on the stats and uh, unlock requirements on rocksolidindustries.com. Uh, I mean, rocksolid.com. There is a, a lovely part comparison tool that displays all the available stats for the weapon along with unlock levels. If you like this video, or you'd like to go see more MAV videos, follow my channel, or subscribe to it, and follow me on twitch.tv, surge underscore David. Also check out the other places for MAV, our Discord, Reddit, uh, bombdogstudios.com, and uh, anyone else. If you have the game, please jump in on uh, Sundays where we get a bunch of people and fight with the dev. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next video.